right now we'd like to introduce the It's your host Charlie Glass of the Underground Express. You can join me weekdays from Tuesday through Friday at 6.30 p.m. and Saturdays at noon for the Wake and Bake Show. Make y'all get up and dance Been doing this since rent a cops Put X's on my hands Chill. All to the fake Identical pick Match the face Getting fucked up and wasted Way before the legal age So I pull up and Make my way inside Bar stood up Crown and coat Now I'm ready to act the fool What? Me and Ellie on stage Here to ask y'all a question Do you love hip hop? Show me how I act the reckless While y'all have fun Regardless how you living Cause we all here tonight To enjoy this beautiful feeling Woo. Intoxicated simply Cause life is what you make it Bang your motherfucking head Till your vertebrae is free Non stopping hip hop, it is how we been rocking. Wanna be strong, but lack like heart, so they be flopping. Classes like this, that's what keeps it all going. So salute to that and make some motherfucking noise. So if y'all not stopping, then we not stopping. Cause we both know the party won't stop. And if y'all not rocking, then we not rocking. Cause we both came different hip hop. So if y'all not stopping, then we not stopping. Cause we both know the party won't stop. Especially if a good time, how you just took this Came with it to change minds, raise eyes Keep your girl's body moving with that good vibe Love in the interjection, connecting the who's who Yup, not those two, oh you mean those two? Yeah, who knew? Still cool, let them rock too Pour a cup for them, knock back a few Get a look at the side of it, we always see Not me, take the curtain down, bow out please Keep the bottle on me, consider it a token of my appreciate Wait, that's you to me, no collar needed, more comfortable in a team Still get the grown man on if you need to see Rather connect than be and worry about my sleeve Grab your cup, throw it up, now let the chorus ring So if y'all not stopping, then we not stopping Cause we both know the party won't stop And if y'all not rocking, then we not rocking Cause we both came here for hip hop So if y'all not stopping, then we not stopping Cause we both know the party won't stop You're listening listening to Charlie Charlie Glass, Glass. Underground Underground Express. Express. Yes, Charlie Glass, Wednesday night, baby boy. We're about a minute away from that interview with Chicago rap artist Conflict doing his thing. What y'all remember, we got the radio station over there that plays the underground music 24-7 all over the world, www.hhparadio.com. It's Hip Hop Port Authority. Go ahead and like that Facebook page. Just did an update to the uh, Underground Express dot is in the house dot com. Page, you can go there and check out the hot links. I got uh, my boy Charlie Pixar's page up there, Fresh Entertainment CD, CT, my bad. It's freshentertainmentct.com, doing it big up there. Again, HHPA is Hip Hop Port Authority. Want everybody to go vote us for your newest and your latest and your loveliest underground hip hop radio show right there. We're trying to do it big, bring y'all the people and give that platform to everybody out there um, who has stayed in support with the underground rap. So, we're going to go over on to this line in the 773 area code and talk to the man of the hour right there. Conflict. Yo. How you doing, brother? Chill it, man. What's good with you over there? We're doing well. We're doing well, my brother. I appreciate you taking the time out of the schedule and the rap game to talk with us here on the Underground Express. Uh, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself to the world, let everybody know what you're doing, brother. <laughs> what up, y'all, man? I go by Conflict. Doing the thing, you know what I mean? I got fucking just dropped the album, Birth. It's on iTunes, Google Play, Amazon, the whole nine. You just heard a single off of it, Ain't None Pretty. It's dropped. That's my second single off. You can find the next level as well. Both videos on YouTube. Um, doing the thing with my boy Majesty, man, Team LE. We got a mixtape coming out. You can hear the singles on my Reverb Nation page. And you know, man, I want to thank you for this opportunity to have me, man. It's, it's, 
beautiful thing. Definitely, definitely. And, you know, when they said Chicago, I said, yo, this is, this is another, again, we, you know, we get them from all over the world, that flavor. I just heard you got a lot of acoustic things going on. We don't get to, you know, hear a lot of different different parts of the country. Um, so you represented well for Chi town tonight. Um, talk to us about how long you've been in the game and um, this whole this whole acoustic field. Talk to me about it. What um, what goes well, into making a conflict record? Well, I've been doing it for a little bit, man. I dropped a few mixtapes, tapes, uh, got contractions out there. Uh, that did pretty well, and then this acoustic thing, man. You know, it's it's music. At the end of the day, it's all music, and people do their thing as well outside the hip hop genre. And when you blend it all together, you get that. You know what I mean? And you know, it's just bringing out the music side of things. It's not just about going out there and killing the beat. If you actually, you know, listen to to build ups and you know what I mean, drops and things like that, you'll see that uh, you can create something incredible and throw it out there and see how the public reacts to it. You know, and they're reacting well. Um, definitely, we introduced the the record to the hhpa.radio.com playlist um, the other day. Got quite a few people. Again, I'm an old school head, so you know, for me, that's very refreshing. Um, coming off of you know everything that's going on right now, I always like to to dance to my head fall off. Um, listening to things like you say, you know, you got to go hard body on everything and body everything that 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 comes out. Um, yes. so I could appreciate that. What, um, where will you fit in the game? I mean, this is totally different again from a lot of things that I, I know you send me a bunch of, um, things to listen to. Um, you have a wide diverse range of what you do. Talk to us about your different styles and what type of artists influence you. Well, my influence came from a lot of, like, 90s hip-hop. I like people who talk about things. I like people who, who describe what they've been through, artists who have their stories, and this is my story, you know, and this is what I bring to the table, the things I've been through and all of that, and I honestly think it's just in the own lane of itself. Uh, it could be compared to, you know, regular hip-hop. It could be compared to um, some blues, some things like that. I touch a, lot, a wide range, and it's just feeling. It's based off feeling things that I feel that touch me personally, things that I've been through personally, and it's just this is my story, you know, and, and it, it came from everybody else telling their story. That's what influenced me. I listen to a lot, like I said, 90s hip-hop, just things that are just people who have stories to tell. That's what touches me. So, you know, I give mine in return. Definitely. I re I respect that. Again, you come from a, a solid background of spitters who are, who are world, you know, lyrically known, the Lupe's of the world are common, you know, quite a few people. I'm going to even go back and say um, uh, the brat, you know, I, I get a lot of yeah. consciousness coming out of Chicago. So, you know, I definitely respect the move and what you do. What do you feel about yeah, the state of the game you, right now? And, 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 and where are you with, with, with how hip-hop has transcended into, you know, it's all over the place. Talk to me about what yeah. you feel about the state of the game. Well, being from over here, from Chicago, man, there's, you know, honestly, there's a lot of negativity over here, and there's a lot of game banging, a lot of things like that in our music, in our hip-hop over here. And a lot of things have, you know, you know, a lot of negative things have happened as a backfall of that. And where I'm at in the game, I'm just pretty, you know, I'm trying to trying to make it aware that it's not all about that over here, man. There's actually people who have things to say, who have great positive stories to tell. And, yeah, we come from a rough area and we go through, you know, what they're calling a the Chirac right now. We're averaging 40 homicides a weekend. This is retarded over here. But if you take away that fact there's actually good things still happening and, you know, we can still make a difference in things like that. I don't want our city to be ruled out, you know, we're, we're not really all about that. We, we do good things as well. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. That's, um, that's a worldwide epidemic and I'm glad you touched on it because again, through the music, we're, we're able to transcend people and, and have a different thought process and ideology about, who we are as people just because we're born into it don't mean that we're all maniacs and i could appreciate yeah. them words that you're just speaking right there um talk to me again about you know what your plans are for your new mixtape are you planning to go on a small tour what's your attitude about you know going independent versus uh that major label game is it even on the table for you what do you have in mind 
Well, I just dropped the album, and right now I'm just focused on pushing it, trying to get it out there. Uh, tours are in talks. There's are things being scheduled. Uh, it just needs to all come together, and then definitely it'll happen, and then I'll release statements and things like that. Everybody's going to know what's up. You check out the Reverb Nation page. Um, you can check out, you know what I mean, my Facebook, my Twitter, things like that. I, I, I stay in touch with the world, and I let people know, you know, what's going on. Um, everything's definitely going to happen. It's just a matter of time of getting it all together. You know what I mean? Now, as far as do you have uh, YouTube videos up there? Do you have a video um, page or channel, anything going on like that? Yes, Conflict LE on YouTube. You can subscribe to me. Uh, the next level video is up there right now, and the Ain't Nothing Pretty video will be up there by tonight. All right, definitely be looking for that, and we'll post that on the page as well. Again, we offer this platform for artists like yourself, so you know we can hear all the different flavors from around the world, and it's almost yeah, a common the theme. Thing over there, man. Definitely, it's a common theme talking to people, you know, on the West Coast, Midwest, East Coast, that everybody wants to be unified and to 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 keep the integrity of the hip hop movement going. Yeah, um, yes, sir. And we we definitely need more time like this, so I appreciate that definitely. Um, who are some of the people that you champion right now? Again, some of your influences. Talk more specifically to me. So you mentioned the 90s. I know the 90s are real big. You're a lyrical type of person. Um, right. As of you right have any now, any? yeah. As of right now, um, Kendrick Lamar I like. I like Wale. Um, J. Cole, he's, he's pretty dope. Uh, Joey Badass, man, he's actually caught my eye a lot as well. Um there's definitely you know, there's a, a lot of buzz on Joey in the last couple of weeks. Say what? Definitely a lot of buzz on Joey Badass uh, for the last couple of weeks. I'm you know seeing him all over the all over the internet like that. You know, yeah. mentioning that um, the attack virally um, on the internet. How important is that to your team and what you're doing um, to maintain you know fans and to keep things going? Because now you have control. Everybody pretty much has their own control of, of what they're doing out there. Yeah, I mean, the Internet's changed a lot of things. Everybody's got their own lane and all of that. Um, the best thing about it is that it's communication. It's the, the way you can reach people through it. Um, you know, you anybody could throw their own page out there, but who are you going to reach through it? You know what I mean? It depends on how hard you push it as well, you know? It's not just there just to benefit. You got to make it work for yourself. So, you know, you got to go out there and reach the people as much as you can and do whatever you could to do that. So it's it's a huge part, but you have to use it the right way. You know what I mean? Definitely. Uh, we appreciate your time, my brother. Thank you very much for doing this interview with us, and we'd like to stay in touch over the new year because we have a lot of big things that are going to be popping off. Uh, for those of you who are listening, th there will be a video um, posting of this on YouTube shortly so you'll be able to just hear it on the Facebook directly instead of go over to all these pages and find out what it says. I'll send you the link as well. But, um, again, I appreciate your time, my brother, and go ahead and give you a shout-out. And uh, we look Thanks forward for to having talking me, to you again. Man. Thanks for having me. Um, shout-out to Team LE. Shout-out to everybody in Chicago. Keep your heads up. You know what I mean? We're doing things over here. So thanks for having me once again. I really, really appreciate this opportunity. Smoke something. You fucking haters. You're rock rocking with Charlie Glass. Charlie Glass. 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 Glass.